So this is a quick unboxing. I've just got the DJI RS4. This is a gimbal. Uh, all I'm going to do is unbox this, show you what you get with it. I've got to charge it and then I'm going to go out and take some footage. And in the second video, I'll show you the kind of stability you can get. I'll do some handheld footage, show you what it's like on my camera with me just walking around, probably chasing my dogs. Then I'll shoot with this. I uh, haven't used it before, as you can see. I'm not an expert with gimbals. It will be interesting to see just how smooth the footage is when I use this. So let's have a look what's inside. Apologies for the noise as I break into this. Now, I should also say that I was lucky enough to be sent this for review. Not by DJI. But by One's going to be a connecting cable for your camera. We have the um, adjustment plate. This is for the lens and the um, the rig itself. Silicon I don't need. This looks to be the mounting plate, uh, the hot shoe mount, and we can get to it. Yep, that is. So we'll put that safe. I guess this is going to be the battery and all that good stuff and the handle. So this, and again, it's all sealed, so... Oh, tripod handle. Quite solid. The instruction book, yeah, the instructions. And another base plate here. Again, all nice sealed. So this is the adjusting base plate, which we will use uh, for mounting and balancing. And then this must be the battery handle, I guess. Yeah, so that's the power, and uh, let's have a look. Doesn't look like it's charged at all. Lights are not coming on, so that's fine. And now we get into the good bit itself. It's very well sealed, so let's just break into it. Okay, so this is remarkably solidly built. Good weight to it. Uh, there's various protective plastic on it, which I'll take off in a second. But I'm going to show you, uh, in fact, I'll take that off now, and then I'm going to show you some close-ups. So we'll connect this, get it powered up, and then I'll have a look at the footage, see what it's like, show you in a subsequent video, and then you can see what you think of it for a beginner like me who has no idea how to use a gimbal. Now, it was only an unboxing, quick one, hope you've enjoyed it, and I hope you do watch the next video, because I'll show you the actual real-life results, the very first footage I take. Uh, if I make a mess of it, I will take extra footage and show you what happens when I learn my mistakes. But right out of the box, I'll show you the kind of results we get with this. I'll probably do a balancing uh, video as well, because I know that can be difficult with some of these things. But this is meant to be a lot easier because it's Teflon coated and all that kind of good stuff.